Well, hello everybody. Good morning. Welcome to day dos. <laughs> We're making our way towards Sand Beach. That is the other uh, road. It's not only the Sand Beach, there's other attractions in that area, but I guess that's the main. Yeah, there's just so much to do on this island from intertwined little towns and villages within the National Park and so many different things in the National Park. So keep that in mind when you come up here. It's big and it's really cool and, and kind of spread out. So take your time, take a few days and remember, enjoy the journey. was insanity miles of cars lined up and not to mention the parking lot being full cadillac mountain was, it was perfect organized yeah. and it seemed perfect yesterday today i'm not overstating it if i say between the full parking lots and people parked on the road that there were a thousand cars lined up and it's only one way in and since we have the dogs and stuff with us it would literally be probably a couple miles just to walk back there to the beginning of where <laughs> to, to start to check out the trail and everything for yeah. sand beach so unfortunately as much as we want to see it and as popular as it is i don't know that we're gonna going to be able to do that today it's too crazy too crowded for our liking especially well we just don't like crowded places to begin with like it's not not appealing to us anymore so we are we kept going down and when the line of cars actually stopped is on the next attraction it's called thunder hole thunder hole so there is like a little area they have a shop and we found parking here the entire park is gorgeous and there's so many different things to do so we're just gonna keep going and skip that one thing <laughs> yeah. that's one of the biggest things for this lifestyle and for seeing these national parks and stuff is your main goal is to enjoy it be safe and have fun and to do that you have to be flexible yes so correct we're being flexible today we were flexible last night with food. We learned our <laughs> lesson, so we are going to make, make reservations. reservations tonight. Instead of Sand Beach, like we promised, we are going to show you some other places, Thunder Hole being one of them. And we know we'll enjoy it, so we're sure you guys will too. It may not seem like it here with a calm and serene setting, but Thunder Hole actually gets its name from rough days with rough seas as waves can be seen and heard with a thunderous clapping sound as they crash into the rocks and send spouts of water sometimes reaching 40 feet into the air. Well, this is a little bit of Sandy Beach from far. We just have zoom on. So we saw Sandy Beach. Good thing we got the reservations. Leaving Thunderhole behind, we quickly traded ocean views for beautiful lakeshore drives as we took in the panoramic views of the stunning Eagle Lake. Once we made our way through several parts of the park, we quickly realized that overcrowding and street parking were a very common issue that day. So we decided to drive through a couple little towns on the island before making our way to a much anticipated meal. I am extremely excited. First, we're at Blaze. It's right on the main strip. There's a bunch of places, and there's actually a place right next door that looks amazing. But Blaze has a full menu of their own craft beers and craft cocktails to start that all look amazing. It's hard to choose. So 
sorry guys. We wanted to give you the pretty setup. I was hungry and kept eating. Everything we've had here is amazing. Doesn't matter what's on the menu. Order it and it's gonna be good. These are the Jamaican style steak tacos. Phenomenal. Everything here has been great. With our stomachs full after eating a meal fit for a king, or in our case, two would-be YouTubers, we set our sights on the next adventure. This piece of sand. We saw it the day before at Cadillac Mountain, and we jumped in the van and started driving around all the island in search. But we realized it was on the outskirts of Bar Harbor. So we made our way back and walked down this tiny street to realize it was covered in water. So we said, it's time to eat, and we made our way back into town so I could get the elusive lobster sandwich. Cider. Cider and a lobster roll. <laughs> With a view. With an amazing view. So we're about to sit on a bench, watch this amazing sunset. And there is, oh, there you go. There is an old sailboat right here. I'm gonna choose. Wow. <laughs> so good. Look at that lobster. Chunks of lobster coming out of that. Phenomenal.